Hello everybody! Welcome back to my channel, to my video. I am Sunny, your North Country Knitter, and this is an unboxing video. Alright, today I am unboxing a Knit Crate box. It is not a new video. There are several others out there that are probably, you know, a little more detailed than what I'm going to be. Um, I'm just giving you a initial feel, initial emotion, initial thoughts of the box. Um, this is my second box I'm getting from them. I used to get Yarn Crush, um, but they sort of merged with Knit Crate. Um, Joanne started working, became my creative designer, creative something with Yarn Crush. See, this is why I shouldn't do these boxes because, or unbox these videos because I get my facts all wrong. Anyway, suffice to say, they kind of merged. So <laughs> now I get Knit Crate. Um, I'm very excited about this one because as I, I've seen what the yarn is, uh, but they worked with Creative Grandma on this yarn. So um, I'm going to go ahead and open it up. If you are new to my channel, hello, I'm Sunny. You can find me here on YouTube. You can also find me on Instagram at North Country Knitter. You can also find me on Facebook at North Country Knitter. Um, I do yarn, knitting, podca podcast, vlog type videos. Um, and also we're going to see about doing some more unboxing videos. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button because this year I am trying to grow as a channel and you can also subscribe by hitting the subscribe button and the little bell notification, which will tell you when I post a new video. Okay. That's all over with. Let's get into the happy mail. So this is Knit Crate. I have not looked in this box. All I have done is cut the tape. Uh, because I'm one of those people who always thinks I'm going to slice my finger open as I try to open a box. So I do it off camera. Alright, here we go. Ooh, that is pretty. Pretty paper. There it is. Yay! So this is the cool version. The cool version of the yarn. Um, you can also get warm what I would call warm and neutral but it's they have different terms so it's we'll get into those in a second so here is the yarn oh it's very smushy tightly wound um, created grandma undying wools by knit crate so it is colorway sky it is 80% superwash merino 20% percent tensile. Um, I hope I say that right. It is a sport weight at 350 yards. Uh, you can machine wash on cold and tumble, tumble dry low. And these wool yarns are made exclusively for knit crate. So very smushy, very, very soft. They are very soft. And for a little extra this month, ooh, that is a nice big button. Very nice. I like that color too. Ooh, it feels like pewter. And it's made by Incomparable Buttons. Giving empowerment to women in South Africa. Handmade fully washable buttons. Very nice. I like that. Oh, I didn't say that this is February's box. This is February's box, by the way. Hopefully y'all got that clue when I said it's by Creative Grandma or worked with. Um, so here's the little catalog for them this month. There she is. Glenda Winkleman. I think that's how you pronounce her last name. I'm horrible with names. So, so the three colorways you could have gotten were Chill Out. That's what I got, which is the colorway Sky. Sprout, which is the all natural, and that is um, that is that what I call the neutral, and flirt, which is the energize me, 
and that's what I call um, the like reddish tones. So I will move that closer so you guys can see. Very pretty. I am happy with the blue. It looks um. like it looks a little darker in the pictures in reality it's a little lighter so looks like here we go they have the patterns are knit and crochet so for the knit that looks like they have hat and hand warmers I don't think I'm going to be able to get that close enough and clear enough for you to really see it good. Um, and here's the crochet version. I'm not going to show any of the pattern details. And yeah, so it looks like I don't know if it tells you skill level. <laughs> All right, I don't see an actual skill level. We're going to give it a go, though. <clears throat> Hopefully. I have a hard time working things up in a timely manner. So <laughs> by the time I get these worked up, we may not need them anymore until next season, and then I'll be very happy I have them. Um, and then I think they give you sneak peeks, not peeks, but like clues as to next month yeah so in March these are kind of the clues theme peak is what they call them for next month so I am very happy with this yarn I can't wait to work up with it I'm just gonna sit here like this for a little bit it's very pillowy soft <laughs> um if you have this Tell me down below if you worked with it, what you thought of it. Um, I do not know much about Creative Grandma. I'm looking forward to reading more about her. I have seen a couple of her videos. I haven't, I have not been able to like sit down and watch them. Um, but I am looking forward to, it's definitely something I'm gonna do. I'm gonna look more into her channel because she has a channel here on YouTube and see what I learned. I'm sure I'll learn some stuff. All right, guys, that is my yarn, my, my yarn for the month from Knit Crate. I'm very happy with it and I can't wait to work something up. I hope you all have a <clears throat> wonderful week and I will see you here next time. Bye guys.